you the most about portraying Scarlet? About po sorry, I can't portraying eat. Scarlet. Oh. <laughs> that I'm reading things going. I've done that. <laughs> um, but it's it's so exciting to be able to. Um, she's turned out to be such a role model for a lot of people, and you know, Twitter blows up with all these girls and, and, and guys as well, just you know, cheering her on. It's wonderful to see people behind her, and she's such a um, she's the reluctant kind of. Um, you know, it's, it's not about fame for her. It's music. It's, she she is music. She's um, every everything from this beautiful little thing southern accent that I get to do, which is such a privilege. Um, to the way the way she just kind of dances to her own beat, which is a little bit off. And people think somebody said you know, Scarlett always looks like she's an alien. It's like, well, she's you know she's kind of yeah, there's nothing wrong with that. Um, but uh, it, she's a pleasure to play, and I'm so grateful that somebody like Kelly Puri created her. And, and When somebody's treating you badly, you can fall out of love with them gradually without even knowing. And then, uh, you know, she didn't she didn't transfer affection immediately. Actually, he came after her first. Um, and then you have the added situation of him being in agony over the grief of his, you know, his brother is gone, and she sees that she sees him broken. And she's, you know, they're, they're the best of friends. She loves him. He's standing over there. That's why I keep looking at him. <laughs> He's got the silliest hat on. Um, she's, it, it's, it's tumult at the moment. It's like having a jar of sand and water and you shake it up and everything's swirling and there are all these colours and you can't see clearly and sometimes when you can't see clearly you need something to hang on to and, and hopefully it's your best friend. Sounds beautiful. Thank you very much.